in the uh, in the days of Arthur Ashe and uh, Althea Gibson, and Althea was ten years before Arthur. Uh, blacks uh, couldn't play in a lot of clubs because uh, a lot of tennis was played in country clubs and other places that just didn't admit blacks. And so it is uh, especially significant that today there is a black woman who is the chairman of the board, CEO and president of the United States Tennis Association. Her name is Katrina Adams. And uh, I'm very proud of her. I call her my daughter. But in the, in the old days, they had the American Tennis Association, ATA. And so the championships were played at a place called Shady Rest in Scotch Plains, New Jersey. And that was where Arthur and Althea and a whole lot of others played. And the, the ATA was the black USTA of the day. Uh, today, of course, uh, blacks are playing all over the world, literally all over the world. And, uh, but in the old days, there were just a handful of courts around where people could play one of which was uh, uh, called the Cosmopolitan, and which was located at uh, 149th and Convent Avenue. Uh, they, they built a apartment building there later, and the address was 441 Convent Avenue. Uh, and, and incidentally, where my bride and I lived for six months or so when we first got married in 1953. But when the Cosmopolitan, when the court was, was open and people were playing on it, the problem was it didn't have any back court. Uh, and so uh, there was a fellow named Johnny Chandler who was short and fast and he used to literally run up the wall, run to the back and run up the wall to return the shot. Uh, as I say, those were the days. Uh, I am uh, constantly amazed at, at the progress that has been made. Uh, we we uh, are fond of saying that uh, Things are not yet what they should be. Uh, every year in February, uh, Dr. King's birthday and Black History Month, we talk about uh, uh, the answer to the question whether or not uh, we've achieved Dr. King's dream. And my constant response is not yet. We have improved, come a long way, but things are not yet what they need to be. Thank God they're not what they used to be.